Hi there. There's a new generation of milk taxi, and we want to take a close look at it today. Dr. Rose, who's responsible for the milk taxi, will kindly present the new developments for us. I know that Holman Lauer is the inventor of the milk taxi. You were the first to present a pasteurization solution, and I'm also familiar with version 3.0 with the large wheels, the large display, and remote control. But to be honest, I really can't imagine how any major improvements can be made to bucket feeding. I can believe that you can't imagine that. But that is perhaps also our strength, that we solve problems that no one can imagine. Let me show you. Please feed these calves. But wait a second, how many litres is that calf getting? Do you notice something? You've got a problem. And that's a problem that everyone feeding several calves has. You have to know how old the calves are and how much they should get. That's virtually impossible when you have lots of calves. OK, so what's the solution? Go up to the box and take a look at the display. It's jumped to 2.5 litres. Yes, the calf is five days old and should get 2.5 litres. Mm -hmm. Ah, oh, it's jumped to 3.5 litres. The calf is much older. The milk taxi identifies the calves, knows the age, and uses it to calculate the respective amount it should drink. How does that work? Exactly. Every box has a transponder. Our milk taxi recognizes this and thus also knows the calf. We allocate an optimum drinking curve to each calf, and so we're able to adapt the amount of milk precisely to the age. This used to only be the case with automatic feeders. Wow, that revolutionizes bucket feeding. Yes, we're quite proud of this. But that's by no means all. Let's pretend you're preparing the milk taxi for feeding. Let's go into the milk chamber. But wait a second, how many litres do I need? Do you notice something? You've got another problem. But our new milk taxi has a solution for this too. It knows how much milk you need for the next feed. Take a look here. In our case, 136 litres. And how do you do that now? I know what you're getting at. If I need 136 litres of a certain concentration, then I have to know beforehand how much water and milk powder I need. I've seen farmers who work with a sort of table which they use to calculate the values. Yes, but that's complicated. We can do this much more elegantly. You ascertain your shovel size and what concentration of feed you want. Once these values have been input, the milk taxi shows you how much water and powder you need to fill into it. And the highlight of this is that the milk taxi knows how much water has already been filled and how much you still need. That's really great. But what do people do if they want to mix in whole milk? The milk taxi then identifies how much whole milk has been filled and calculates how much water and powder you need for the desired concentration. This means it's also possible to enhance with whole milk. That's really innovative. No matter how much whole milk you use, the concentration is always the same in the end. No one else has this. Exactly. This is why we also won an award from the DLG for it. Should we go one better? Then take a look here. I know that. It's Calf Guide, the calf management program for automatic feeders. No? That's Calf Guide for Milk Taxi. You mean that you now also save all of the data for the milk taxi? Exactly. You can view the complete history. When was how much fed and at what temperature? When did pasteurization occur and for how long? And you can access the current status of the milk taxi at any time. For example, whether the pasteurization has already been completed. What do you think? For what farms is the milk taxi particularly interesting? Work is made easier for employees and the calves are fed reliably and precisely. This is interesting for any farm. 
The fact that the feeding can be better monitored and everything is precisely documented is certainly very important for farms with changing staff. Okay, I understand. But if I bought a Milk Taxi 3.0 from you a year ago, then I have to buy another one now. No. All the functions for the Milk Taxi 3.0 can be retrofitted. Wow, great. So the Milk Taxi 3.0 can become 4.0. Congratulations on the innovations. Thank you very much. And thank you very much for the lovely chat. My pleasure. And now I'll get on with feeding calves.